She gets to make the calls about what does or doesn't get built. Like my build. It's no easy feat to get all these oak blocks. Your petition was very well handled. Oh, gosh. That's nice of you. I just don't understand why everyone shouldn't be allowed to build. Ha! <laughs> what a sentiment. I mean, it is a good thought, but it's crazy. The founder isn't accepting visitors right now. How's it going, Lucas? I'm okay. Just watching these guards. They really mean business. Yeah, I wouldn't mess with them if I were you. And where should I put them? Yes, just get them here. I'll deal with them. Get out of here. Go, go! Uh, why, hello there. What can I do for you? I'm not sure what the custom is where you come from, but uh, here, <laughs> it is considered impolite to stare. What, uh, what was that all about, with the whispering and the sticks? Ah, shh, I don't know what you're talking about. None of that here. It's, <laughs> not stick allowance day, after all. So, why would I, a, a humble innkeeper, have sticks? <laughs> Seriously, just put all of that out of your mind. It's, it's not important. It was just friends exchanging pleasantries. <laughs> Nothing more to see there. <laughs> wow, dude, could you be more suspicious? Come again? You're just giving off a real shady vibe. And the more you protest, the shadier you seem. Just saying. Well, if I wanted your opinion on my shadiness, I would have asked for it. As I didn't, please throw your shade elsewhere. Was there something you needed? I'm sorry, but I'm actually quite busy. Inns don't keep themselves, you know. Lots of busy work. Okay, seriously, Guy, what's your deal? I mean, are you on the run? Undercover? Oh, I see. Just because I don't want to speak with you, that means I must have a deal. Maybe I just don't want to speak with you. I'm sorry, but it's like I told those other outsiders. I can't help you. Now, please. Hey, this is our guy? He tell you where to find the blaze rods? How many of you are there? I told you, I don't know anything. He hasn't told you anything yet. Is he hiding them somewhere? I am uncomfortable with this line of questioning. Come on, you can trust me. Nothing bad is going to happen. Just help us. Fine. If it will make you leave me alone, that Aiden fellow did come talk to me earlier. Wanted to know where the Eversource was. Called it! I just told him what everyone else already knows. The Eversource is in the palace with the Founder. That's all that happened, I swear. What a bunch of creeps! Yes, I wasn't terribly fond of them. So where is Aiden now? The group left for the palace, and I haven't seen them since. Attention! Attention, everyone! Just a moment of your time, please. Emergency meeting attendance is mandatory. Oh, slime blocks. Curious. I wonder what that's all about. Oh, it's the founder. I wonder what this is all about. Yes, I'm nervous being surrounded by so many people. Guys, I think I found the blaze rods. Oh, no. What are they doing? People of Sky City, I'm sorry to pull you from your duties, but something urgent has come to my attention. A crime has been committed. A crime? What kind please, of crime? Please, please remain calm. Earlier today, outsiders built a bridge into our fair city from a distant island. Now, whether these outsiders know it or not, this is a violation of Sky City's most sacred law. No unauthorized building. Wait, is that you? Are 
you the bridge builders? Obscene! The builders! Atrocious! Everyone! Everyone! Please! Well? How could we have known about that? We just got here. Lucas! Shut it! Jesse, wherever you are, step forward now. I have already been informed of your identity. I appreciate that you may be ignorant of our laws. But I will warn you, Sky City is small, and I promise that if you try to hide, I will find you. We need to get to the Eversource at whatever cost. This is clearly our fastest way into the castle. By getting arrested? Wait! Don't be fooled by the Founder's lies. I can help you come up with a plan to get into the palace. Here I am! I built the bridge! Are you crazy? Does she look like she's gonna help us? Hey! Unhand me! Come with me! This is completely unnecessary! Jesse, we need to get out of here! Hey, don't treat him like that. We didn't do anything wrong. <gasps> the builders! Huh. Knew you'd see it my way. Thank you, Jesse. Hey! Hands off the road. Guards, bring them forward. Jesse, I... I'll find a way to help you, I promise. Let go of me this instant! Excuse me! Excuse me! Come with me. We meet at last. <laughs> <laughs> Who's snickering? What's that noise? Hey, you're the founder, right? It's nice to meet you, Jesse. My name's Jesse. So I gathered. Hmm. I admire your honesty in stepping forward. This should be interesting. service to Sky City. I grant you these gifts. There, see? I grant she summoned. It must lead to the Eversource. Really? That's what you're focusing on? I'd say we have bigger problems on our hands. Like Aiden. Look at him all friendly with the Founder. That's bad news. I'm right. You'll see. Take your reward and enjoy the bounty of Sky City's generosity. Carrots? Really? You gotta be kidding. We are honored, wonderful founder. Of course. Now go. I have criminals to deal with. Good luck, Jesse. I hope you like being doomed. Totally doomed. Blaze rods. Going down, Aiden. I'm gonna stop you. Not this time, Jesse. Out of my way, Reggie. It's Reginald. Come on, criminals. Time to see the founder. Jesse and accomplices. You have committed acts of wanton and illegal building, something specifically forbidden by our laws. Explain yourself. This could still turn out okay. Are you kidding? She does not sound friendly. But I didn't know it was against the law when we started to build. We were stranded. What are we supposed to do? Ignorance won't get you any favors. Aiden told me all about you, Jesse. About how you're a tyrant back home. About how you and your Order of the Stone steal all the world's treasures for yourself. About how you're here to steal the Eversource from my city. A terrible act of treason. Listen, Founder, Aiden's a master manipulator. He'd say anything to get his hands on the Eversource. <laughs> Much like you would seem to be doing right now. Jesse, it's clear that you're the little ringleader. So how about you come with me? Um, okay. Uh, I guess we'll just wait here then. Tell me what you see. I don't see anything. It's just empty.
precisely. As you can see, nothing exists below us, only the void. Resources, every kind, are incredibly precious. And when something falls, it is gone forever. It is why building only happens when I dictate it. People only receive materials when I allow it. Otherwise, we would collapse back into chaos. It is my duty to keep my people safe. And the only way I can do that is if our laws are obeyed. Yeah, but it's still wrong. People should be allowed to build and craft whatever they want. Aiden had warned me you were dangerous, but now I am truly beginning to understand what a threat you are. <sighs> People act as though I want things to be this way. Allocating the limited resources. Risking my life every day. so tired of people being so cryptic about this thing. Just tell me what it is. It is my burden, my curse. I'll have you know that before I found the Eversource, this world was nothing more than a cluster of pathetic islands in the sky. I do this for my people. That is why I do what I do. But you don't need to do it alone. We could help you. We could work together. <sighs> Being the leader of this city, it is a tiring burden. Uh, but no, this is my city. These are my people. And it is my responsibility. I think I've heard quite enough. Good. Now that you're back, we can talk properly. Reginald, I've made my decision. While I'm not convinced that you are here to steal the Eversource, the fact remains that you constructed a bridge of dirt without authorization. That is why you and your companions are to be detained <gasps> until I can discern the full truth of the matter. Reginald, please remove them. Yes, ma'am. What? Come on, I wanted to help you. Don't do this. I'm afraid this is the way it has to be. Sorry, outsiders. Founder's orders. No changing your mind now. Fascinating stuff here. You suck. Hey, I'm just doing my job. <laughs> Whatever, Reggie. Oh, wow. What is this? That's fine. It's almost like dirt, but not. It's called sand. You've never seen sand before? Sand? Wow. What's it do? Are you kidding me? We are not going to explain sand to the guy locking us behind bars. I refuse. Well, whatever it does, it's going in the chest with everything else. <laughs> Nothing sadder than an unimportant man on the world's tiniest power trip. Hey, I don't have to take this. I'm in charge here. You're criminals. Aiden told everyone all about how horrible you are. <clears throat> he said that you burn down trees just for fun. That you steal all the world's treasures and hoard them for yourself. He also said that you tame wild animals just so you can make them chase innocent people. You can't believe a thing Aiden says. He's a liar. He said that you'd say that. I suppose that's probably what a liar would say. I'm sorry, but this is the way it has to be. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go help the Blaze Rods beef up security. Can't believe I'm taking orders from that sniveling little... 
<clears throat> Stay here. Don't cause any trouble. I'm sure you'll be very comfortable. Reginald, you've got to listen to me. Aiden's tricked the Founder so that he can steal the Eversource for himself. There's not much time... They're personal guests of the Founder, and sure, maybe I don't like them, but... I'm probably just being... paranoid. Reggie, think about it. They want you out of the way. They're upstairs, beefing up security with the Founder while you're what? Down here, locking up prisoners? I'm down here. Who knows what they're telling her? Uh, okay. Let's say you make a good point. And I'm not saying you do. But hypothetically, why would I, captain of the guard, let you, a criminal, out of that cell? I'll never know how you looked at them and thought, there are some upstanding citizens. I know that if you really think about it, you'll see. We should be on the same side here. We're the good guys. <clears throat> Good guys, huh? Hmm. <laughs> okay, let's say I'm heading to the pantry to get you prisoners some bread. Do you, do you see where I'm going with this? How long would you say something like that would take you on average? Probably about as long as it would take someone to get from here into the throne room. Please just get out of here. Get to the throne room and stop the blaze rods. Ha! Ah, nice work! Now, on to the Eversource. I understand wanting to stop the blaze rods, but you can't still really want to steal the Eversource, can you? Honestly, I just don't want Aiden to get his hands on the Eversource. So long as we stop him, that's what's important. Sounds good to me. No way Aiden would do anything good if he had it. Throne room was back this way. Here we are, back in the throne room. Keep your voice down. We don't know if we're alone in here. I don't know. Looks deserted to me. Behind you! Ugh. Hey! Wait, stop! Milo, easy! That's Jesse and Lucas. Jesse, I can't believe we found you! I can't believe you punched me. Ah, uh, yes. I feel absolutely terrible about that. Let me assure you. I can't believe you went with this guy. We should have stayed together. I'm sorry, okay? I had to go with my gut. I'm glad you're all right. We were actually planning to break you out of jail, but I guess you guys have that covered. Hello again, Jesse. It seems fate has destined our paths to cross once more. I had hoped this would be the case. This is all very nice and very sweet, but who the heck are you? You trust this guy, Petra? Yeah, he really helped me. He's cool. 